in the heat of battle. Got it! One of the great catches! When the stakes were at their highest, in the crowd, one Australian cricketer stood tall, Travis Head. Up she goes, Pat Cummins, up she goes! And Australia... Nowadays, one name resonates in the cricketing world, especially on the tongues of Indians, and that's none other than Travis Head. But what sets him apart? It's the thunderous spectacle he created in the final? Yes, in cricket dreams, greatness means more than personal achievements. It's about leaving a mark on your nation's story. Travis Head is that cricket hero for Australia. Playing in a World Cup final isn't easy, but Head makes it look like a walk in the park. His two incredible innings are like winning two gold medals for his country. It's not just about him. It's about making Australia proud on the biggest stage. Oh, he plays that so well. It's 150 here for Travis Head. Travis Michael Head, born 29th of December 1993, is an Australian international cricketer. Travis Head, hailing from Craigmore in the northern suburbs of Adelaide, embarked on his cricket journey with Craigmore Cricket Club and Trinity College, representing South Australia at the under-17 and under-19 levels. He made his mark in the national under-19 championships at the age of 17. Following success in grade cricket with Tea Tree Gully Cricket Club, Head's talent earned him a rookie contract, leading to his first-class debut for South Australia in the Sheffield Shield at 18 in 2012. Despite a promising oh, start, Head faced challenges in reaching his maiden first-class century. In the 2012 Under-19 Cricket World Cup, he played 18 Under-19 one-day internationals, captaining at South Australia to victory in the 2012-13 National Under-19 Championships and earning the Player of the Championship title. After recovering from a car accident in 2013, Head continued to impress, scoring a list a century for the National Performance Squad against South Africa A in July 2014. In February 2015, he was appointed captain of South Australia at the age of 21 becoming the youngest captain in their 122-year first-class history. The 2015-16 season marked Head's emergence as a dominant force in all formats. He became the third Australian to score a double century in Lista cricket, played a pivotal role in South Australia's successful run chases, and secured his maiden first-class century. Notably, he scored a maiden 2020 century for the Strikers. showcasing his versatility. National selectors took notice and Head made his international debut in T20 internationals against India. Returning to Sheffield Shield, he continued to shine, scoring more centuries and leading South Australia to their first final in two decades. Head was named the Sheffield Shield Player of the Year. Head's journey expanded to one-day internationals, ODIs, when he joined Australia's ODI squad for a tri-series in the West Indies. He made his ODI debut in 2016 against the West Indies. There's the mid on that was up. You talked about Mark and uh, he takes and his performances earned him a spot in the Indian Premier League, IPL, with Royal Challengers Bangalore. Representing Yorkshire in county cricket, head broke records and showcased his prowess. His consistent performances led to inclusion in Australia's Test and ODI squads. He played a crucial role in ODIs, including a memorable partnership with David Warner, scoring a maiden century against Pakistan on Australia Day. Despite excelling in limited overs cricket, Head faced challenges in earning a Test spot. However, his fortunes changed in 2018 when he made his Test debut against Pakistan. Look. Just a punch down the ground. Head's test career flourished, and he was appointed Australia's test vice captain in January 2019. Head's international journey continued with the Ashes series, test centuries, and contributions in various formats. His remarkable performances extended to T20 internationals. Wait. Beautifully down the ground. A brilliant innings by Travis Head. In white ball cricket. Head's dynamic performances earned him a place in the ODI squad against England in 2022. He showcased his skills with a career-best 152 in the final ODI. Wonderful way to bring up his third one-day international hundred. Rocks the baby! Forming a formidable partnership with David Warner. 
Ed's resilience and consistent performances across formats have solidified his position as a key player in Australian cricket. But his contribution for Australia cricket history is his two knocks in WTC final and World Cup 2023 final, which led Australia to victories facing early collapse in the WTC final. Aussie hero Travis Head counterpunched with a record-breaking century, reviving his team and paving the way to a 209-run victory and the championship crown. His fearless batting and match-defining century will forever be etched in cricket history. Way. Australia's most attacking batter. Although India are the super team and not lose a single match in all tournament, but in 2023 World Cup final, India's pace attack had Australia reeling at 76 to 3, the dream of a six title seemingly slipping away. Got him. Smith goes. Something but then enter Travis Head. The South Australian Southpaw, known for his audacious stroke play, exploded with a counter attacking century, carving boundaries with audacious ease. His 137-run masterpiece, peppered with 15 fours and four sixes, not only revived Australia but shattered India's bowling spirit. Head's masterful innings formed the backbone of Australia's 241-run chase, eventually securing a six-wicket victory and etching his name forever in cricketing folklore. He was the undisputed hero of the night, the man who rescued a nation's dream and sent the Yellow Army roaring into the history books. Travis Head, the man who silenced Blue Storm, and trashed India two times. He's the man for nation.